When we bought this house, one thing we really loved about it was the space. It had a huge backyard and we had our little boy and we were soon to have twins not long after. We knew that we'd be doing a lot of playing out here and we weren't really cottage people. We love to visit other people's cottages, but we don't have the hours or we don't have family that has a cottage. So our backyard was meant to be our cottage. We had a design that incorporated a couple of different levels, which is something we wanted. We wanted to be raised up so that it was an extension of our family room. Right off the family room is where we have this seating area for dining. It's great to get outside with the kids. It's close to the kitchen. And we knew that we were gonna do a pergola off the back of the house. Having the dining set right underneath it makes it kind of romantic. We have beautiful sconces. And then we have a lounge area. I wanted a big sectional. I wanted to have lots of friends over who could just relax. I wanted to go under an umbrella with a book while my kids are in the hot tub, which brings me to the hot tub. We did eliminate the idea of a pool in favor of a swim spa, which is basically just a gigantic hot tub. We built it off the side of the patio, so it looks like it's part of the patio and it's level with it. Our kids are in it all the time. All year round we run this hot tub and so I think we get more use out of it than we ever would have a pool. The heart of this outdoor kitchen is a really big barbecue. We found this gorgeous one from Napoleon and I also found out they had just put out some outdoor cabinetry which I loved. We've got a bar fridge hidden in there and it allowed for a nice big countertop which we can do buffet style so it's great just to set up a meal and everyone help themselves. On the lower patios where we wanted to do a fire pit. It's river rock and it had the same tones as the concrete and it's just a really great place to sit with some friends and it's a little bit more cozy than the upper patio. I think if my husband had his choice, we would have no color out here whatsoever. But being that I am an interior designer, that was nearly impossible for me to not bring in beautiful fabrics. The paisleys, the trellis, it's very modern, but it feels a little bit traditional. It was absolutely perfect for what I was trying to achieve with the design out here. My husband Sam really loves to dabble in landscape design as well. And he got a really big patch of grass. He's an Italian background, takes a lot of pride in his grass. I think it looks like AstroTurf. And sometimes I wish we'd done AstroTurf because maybe then he would have let me put in that playscape for the kids. <laughs> but it would ruin the grass, so no playscape. Believe it or not, I would call this project finished. Usually I'm never finished. I always have plans, but I'm really happy with everything that we have. This will be our second summer enjoying this backyard, and I can't wait.